Hi everyone, my name is Syed Fayaz Ahmed and I am pursuing BE final year from ISL Engineering College which is located at a beautiful city Hyderabad at in Telangana. Today I am going to present my final year project whose title is Smart Gloves to Convert Sign to Speech for Mute Community. This title I will explain in forward slides. My group mates are Sheikh Samir and Olepu Ashok and we are belongs to Electronics and Communication Department. This is the outline that I will going through as presentation progress. You will encounter all of these topics as it move forward. As I told that I will explain my title that is Smart Gloves to Convert Sign to Speech for Mute Community. Here two things are important. One is Smart Gloves and another is Mute Community. Mute Community means deaf and dumb people's community. Those who can't speak like us, they only express their feelings through gestures or we can say sign language. First of all we see what is mute communication. It means communication through bodily movements, especially hands and arms used when expressing their feelings. These are the examples of mute communication, how they can express their feelings through sign language while communicating. According to the WHO, there are 466 million people across the world are suffering from hearing loss. This is 5% of world's population, of whom 34 million are only children, whereas in India 18 million people have hearing impairment. As we know, deaf and dumb people faces many problems while communicating with the rest of the world population. This communication gap is there because a dumb person uses sign language which is not comprehensible by a normal person. So we are developing a device that will improve the lifestyle of a person who has a speaking disability. And our aim of project is to implement a system which converts gesture to voice commands for deaf and dumb peoples. This is a literature survey which I have done. I have surveyed more papers but here I listed only important one. You can go through it. Now I am going to explain block diagram of our proposed system. The system contains both hardware part and software part. Whereas hardware part includes flex sensor with hand glove, Arduino Atmega 2560, 3 axis accelerometer, APR 33A3 voice playback module, transmitter receiver with electronic switches and power supply. Software part include programming of Arduino. Let's see working of every component. Flex sensor plays a major role in the system. It is a sensor which measures the resistance when it bends. It is directly connected to the Arduino which is shown in figure. In initial state, the flex sensor resistance is about 30 kilo ohms. Whenever the sensor bends from its initial position, the resistance value will be increases. Flex sensor resistance is directly proportional to the angle measure. Gloves with flex sensor. Here, the gloves is shown with flex sensors 
whenever the finger bends the sensor also bend because it is stitched to glove and the output of the sensor is in analog form which is fed to the audio this is an accelerometer accelerometer is an electronic device which is used to measure the movement it has three modes x y and z sensor is only capable of running in one of these three modes at a time and it is used to measure the wrist spins this flow chart shows the working of our device whenever we start the system the resistance of flex sensor and accelerometer will start changing and it fed to a to d converter a to d means analog to digital converter <coughs> it will converts analog output into digital if not change it will check again and again after this output of analog to digital converter will match the predefined values which is shown beside of the flow chart if predefined values matched the output will come from speaker if not matched they will check again this shows interfacing of flex sensor with audino this three pictures are showing the interfacing of flex sensor with audino and these two pictures are showing the interfacing of accelerometer with audino this is the device which look like this uh, conclusion is the system is developed using audino to convert gesture into voice commands due to limitations of voice recording module only eight voices are speak through this module through you know, through this module trade off between the number of voice commands and the cost should be taken into consideration and the last future scope it can be extend into using interfacing with google assistant with by cloud services the precision of the device will be enhanced by using total 10 flex sensors the device flexibility will increase by introducing many languages like hindi telugu etc the home appliance can also be controlled by using node mcu these are the references which i have referred thank you if you have any questions can uh, ask me in